Hey everybody, this is Edger Joe and welcome to another video in my series on um, working with text files. This is video 6 and in this video I want to show you how you can read um, f uh, words from a text file um, into a list. So uh, you can see this is the uh, text file we've been working with and uh, just to read everything in the text file uh, we just use the read command like you've seen in a previous video. So I'm just going to um, run this one and let me just press F5 um, I can't remember I said it's the fifth video it's actually the sixth video if I misspoke earlier but uh, let's have a look I'll just bring this across and there we go so you can see this is from the previous video where I added these two lines so there's five lines in total so um, what we want to try and do in this video is to put every single one of these words every single one of them separately into a list so you might have a piece of text, a paragraph or something like that, and you want to put it into a list. So that's what we're going to attempt to do. So there's a, a neat little um, a, a function uh, called the split function where you can read from a um, any string, any text, and you, it'll just split it up. Um, so I just want to put a little line reading all the contents of a text file um, using the split uh, function. There we go, the split function. And what you do is you actually add it on to this function here. So we've got our uh, variable where we have the opening of our file to read stored. And then we have our reading function. And then just behind that one, I was a uh, split. And then I open and close that. And um, we want to store that into a list. So this is not going to work. I just realized so I'm going to just cut that I'm going to cut that out um, I'm just going to use let's just use a equals and then we're going to do that and then we're going to print a that should work so we're still going to read all of that we're going to split it we're going to store all of that in the variable a and then we're going to print uh, a which will be our list so let's press F5 save that I'll probably have to drag my view across from the output so let's just give it a second and it's very slow there we go so let me just bring this across and there we go there we go so if I just bring this into your view you can see we've got uh, where's my text file let me just grab my text file and um, it's called file let me double click that one there we go so there you can see there is everything we were reading let me just bring that down to there and bring my text file back which I sorry my text file is here sorry I just clicked the wrong one where are we there we go so here we go so let's have a look what happened there so we were opening our file dot txt to read which is this one and then uh, we read it we then split them and save all of that in a variable called a which is our list and um, here you can see we've got every single word. There's our square brackets for our uh, start of our list, the end of the list, and every single piece of string, all the text, the words, is separately stored into this little um, list which we have. So that's a neat little trick as well. If you want to grab some text from um, a text file and split them up into single words, in um, in a list so that you can manipulate or work with that um, list uh, in terms of using something else it could be part it could be usernames and passwords it could be anything like that uh, it could be a dictionary uh, anything like that whatever the text files were for so I hope you enjoyed this little video where you learned how to split um, text files into single words into a list or from from text files into a list let me just close that so thank you for watching this video as always remember to subscribe and um, uh, come back to this uh, channel if you want to know more little tips and tricks um, when working with text files thank you for watching goodbye